Persian cats are known for their beautiful long fur and sweet gentle personalities, making them one of the most beloved cat breeds in the world. However, owning a Persian cat comes with specific challenges and responsibilities that may not be suitable for everyone. In this video, we are going to discuss 10 reasons why you should not get a Persian cat. 10. High Maintenance Grooming Persian cats have very long and thick fur, which means they need a lot of brushing. If you have a Persian cat, you'll need to brush its fur every day to keep it smooth and free from knots. This is because their hair can easily tangle up, and if it gets too tangled, it can turn into mats. Mats are hard clumps of fur that can be painful for the cat because they pull on the skin. Regular brushing helps prevent these mats and keeps the cat's coat nice and shiny. It's important to start brushing a Persian cat when it's very young, so it gets used to the routine. If you don't have the time to brush them often or don't enjoy grooming, a Persian cat might not be the best choice for you. They really need someone who can take good care of their fur. 9. Health Issues Persian cats can have more health problems than some other types of cats. One big issue they face is breathing problems because of their flat faces. This makes it harder for them to breathe, especially when it's hot or they are stressed. Another common health problem in Persian cats is kidney disease, where their kidneys don't work as well as they should. This disease is especially common and can be passed down from parent cats to their kittens. Because of these health issues, Persian cats often need to visit the vet more often than other cats. This can be sad and might cost a lot of money over time. It's important for anyone thinking about getting a Persian cat to know about these health risks so they can be ready to take care of them and help them live happy lives. 8. Shedding Persian cats have a lot of fur, and that means they shed quite a bit. Shedding is when cats lose old or extra hair. Because Persian cats have long, thick hair, they tend to leave a lot of fur on things like sofas, clothes, and carpets. This can be a problem if someone in the house is allergic to cat hair or doesn't like finding fur all over their things. Keeping up with the cleaning can also be a lot of work. You might have to vacuum more often and use lint rollers to clean your clothes. If you're considering getting a Persian cat, it's good to know that you'll need to do extra cleaning around the house to manage all the fur they shed. For some people, this might be too much work, especially if they are very busy or prefer a cleaner, fur-free home. 7. Cost of care. Having a Persian cat can be expensive. This is because they need special care compared to other cats. First, they have to go to the vet often because they can get sick more easily, especially with their breathing and kidney problems. Going to the vet a lot can cost a lot of money. Also, because they have such long and thick fur, they need to be groomed regularly. This might mean taking them to a professional groomer who knows how to take care of their special fur. These grooming visits can also be expensive. Additionally, you might need to buy special products like certain shampoos and brushes just for their fur. All these things add up, making it important for anyone thinking about getting a Persian cat to be ready to spend more money than they might with other types of cats. This helps make sure the Persian cat is happy, healthy, and looking good. 6. Quiet Environment Needed Persian cats usually like things to be calm and quiet around them. They don't do well in noisy or very busy places. If a house has lots of people coming and going, or if there are young kids running around and making noise, a Persian cat might feel scared or stressed. They like a peaceful place where things stay pretty much the same every day. This makes them feel safe and comfortable. Also, Persian cats might not enjoy living with lots of other pets, especially if those pets are very energetic or like to play roughly. Persian cats prefer gentle interactions and quiet environments. So, if your home is always full of activity and noise, a Persian cat might not be the happiest there. It's important to think about what kind of home you have and if it matches what a Persian cat needs to be happy. 5. Eye Maintenance Persian cats have flat faces, and this can cause their eyes to water more than other cats. The water can leave stains under their eyes that look like dark streaks. To keep their face clean and prevent any infections, you need to wipe their eyes gently every day with a soft, damp cloth. This is important because if their eyes are not kept clean, the tears can cause the fur around their eyes to get wet and dirty, which might lead to soreness or an infection. The daily cleaning is just one part of taking care of a Persian cat, and it's something that must be done carefully to make sure you don't hurt their eyes. This task can be a bit tricky, especially for kids, so it usually needs an adult to help out. 
It's good for anyone thinking about getting a Persian cat to know that they will need to spend time every day just cleaning their cat's eyes to keep them healthy and comfortable. 4. Sensitive to heat. Persian cats have thick, fluffy coats that can make them get too hot very quickly, especially during warm weather. Their heavy fur is like wearing a big, warm jacket that they can't take off. Because of this, they need to live in places that stay cool. If it gets too hot, Persian cats can feel really uncomfortable and may even get sick because it's harder for them to cool down compared to other cats. Having air conditioning at home can help a lot, but if you live somewhere that gets very hot and don't have a way to keep the indoors cool, a Persian cat might struggle. It's important to think about where you live and how hot it gets when deciding if a Persian cat is a good fit. They need a cooler environment to be happy and healthy, so keeping them cool is a big part of taking care of them properly. 3. Limited Outdoor Access Persian cats have long, beautiful fur that requires a lot of care, making it hard for them to be outside like other cats. If they go outside, their fur can pick up dirt, leaves, and even bugs, which can make them dirty and uncomfortable. This means they might need even more grooming, which can be a lot of extra work. Also, because their fur is so thick and long, things can get tangled in it easily. Besides the problem with their fur, Persians are not as quick and agile as other cats. This makes it risky for them to be outside, because they might not be able to escape from dangers easily, like other animals or cars. Because of these reasons, Persian cats are usually better off staying indoors where it's safe and clean. This helps them stay healthy and keeps their fur looking good, without the extra mess from the outdoors. 2. Personality Mismatch Persian cats are often very calm and like to relax a lot. They are not as playful or active as some other cat breeds. This means they might not run around or play games as much. Instead, they prefer to sit in quiet spots and enjoy being petted or brushed. Because of their gentle nature, they might not interact a lot, especially when there are many people around or a lot going on. For some people, this kind of personality is perfect because they want a calm and quiet pet. But for others who are looking for a cat that will play a lot, chase toys, or be very lively, a Persian cat might not be the best choice. It's important to think about what you want in a cat's personality. If you're hoping for a cat that will be very interactive and energetic, you might want to consider a different breed that matches those needs better. 1. Litter Box Issues Persian cats have very long and fluffy fur, which can cause a little problem when they use their litter box. Sometimes, their fur can get dirty because it's so long that it touches the litter and catches pieces of it. This can be messy and means they need to be cleaned often to keep them feeling comfortable and to make sure they stay healthy. Cleaning a Persian cat's litter area can be tricky because you need to be very gentle to avoid pulling their fur, which can hurt them. Also, if their fur around the litter box area isn't cleaned regularly, it can lead to bad smells and even skin infections for the cat. So, it's important for anyone who has a Persian cat to be ready to spend extra time making sure their litter area and fur are clean. This extra cleaning helps keep the Persian cat happy and healthy, but it can be a lot of work for their owners. So this was all about today's video. Do let us know your thoughts about it. Please subscribe to All Cats. Thank you for watching.